Welcome back. And so right now, all eyes are on a new AI tool from a China-based artificial intelligence company. It's called DeepSeek. If you haven't heard of it, get used to it. You'll probably be hearing a lot more about it. It's revealing a model named R1. It's like ChatGPT, resembles a lot of other AI models, but this is much cheaper. This morning, the AI arms race now affecting your wallet as a new technology from a small Chinese lab sends big U.S. companies reeling. DeepSeek, a Chinese company, released a virtual assistant fueled by artificial intelligence last week. It quickly climbed to the top of the Apple App Store, fueling a dramatic sell-off of AI stocks yesterday. It is mind-blowing and it is shaking this entire industry to its core. President Trump Trump saying companies should be on notice. The release of deep seek AI from a Chinese company should be a wake up call for our industries that we need to be laser focused on competing to win. DeepSeek says its models perform as well as AI's biggest companies and is much cheaper to make, saying it spent $5.6 million training its model compared to ChatGPT, which spent $78 million. And Google created Gemini, spent $191 million. And some of the companies in China were coming up with a faster method of AI and much less expensive method. And that's good because you don't have to spend this much money. Sam Altman, the OpenAI CEO, posting on X, calling the DeepSeek chatbot impressive, but responded last month to fears about a super intelligence posing an existential threat. I have faith that researchers will figure out how to avoid that. DeepSeek says it collects users' keystrokes and stores information in Chinese servers. Lawmakers warning of security issues with Chinese apps. They abuse the system. They steal our intellectual property. They're now uh, trying to, to get a leg up on us on AI, as you've seen in the last day or so.